All right, so in today's video, I'll be showing you how to update the BIOS on a T490 Lenovo ThinkPad model 20N2 or 20N3 with the flash drive without an OS installed. So the current BIOS version that's on right now is 1.79 slash 1.21. And we'll be updating the BIOS to 1.80, 1.22 released on September 20th so it's September 3rd 2023 so first we're going to download the UEFI utility that is built into Windows so we're going to download it I'm going to go and click give it a few seconds oh we have it right installed so we can just go and press open file <clears throat> Make sure you have a thumb drive with you. So now we're going to go ahead and press... Fuck. Oh, and I was about to close this application. Press yes. Okay. Press next. I'm going to press accept the term agreement. Next. Now you're gonna select not install. You're gonna press extract only. If you press install, this can really mess up your motherboard. So don't screw it up. So press that and then press extract. Now it's extracting the BIOS for the BIOS update. All right, now we're gonna press finish. Now we're gonna go into the file explorer application. Go to this PC. Go to another idea, that's my thing. Go to drivers, go to flash, go to this, and then you can see there's, what? Why are there two files? Okay, it doesn't matter. So I have an older file name. Technically it's the same thing, well. It doesn't matter, so I'm just going to use a newer version of it, so I'm going to delete this one. The other video failed, so I'm going to have to retake it. Alright, so now, once that's done, we're going to open up the folder. Here are the files. We're going to do Control a Control x go to Lenovo IdeaPad, and then go to the Lenovo folder, and then Control v I gotta press do solve current items and I press continue. And now, take your trusty handy USB flash drive, plug into the computer. I am inserting it into the computer. Here we go. Now, we are going to do Windows plus R. Type in CMD and then you're gonna do Control Shift. Enter. Yes. Now we're gonna type in, the first command you're gonna type in is CD. And then you're gonna do CD. Oh wait, oh shit. Um, CD Lenovo. So that's what you're going to type in. Oh, one sec. Oh, this again. Fuck. I got to do this. There we go. So you're going to do CD slash. Now, type in CD. Len. Oh, oh. There you go. So now you're in the file. Now, the next step you're going to type in is... This one at the and do MK USB D. Oh shit. Yeah, that's right. So that's how we're gonna type and then you're gonna press enter. Oh hold on. MK USB dot bat D. Oh wait, shit. Key D. 
that's where you're going to type in and then press enter. And since I already did it, I have the files already installed. We can go ahead and head to the laptop and prepare the BIOS update. So I'm going to safely eject the flash drive. Okay. Now we're ready for the BIOS update. We're gonna go over to the laptop and we'll be right back with part two. Okay, now we're at the laptop. I have the flash drive with me. We are going to first, always safety first, plug in the laptop to power, because that is, what, that is the first step you need to do for the BIOS update. So this power is gonna be plugged in into the side port. So go ahead and plug this in. If I can, There you go. Now, yeah. open this up. Power it on. F11. Power it off because it's on fast boot. Flash drive. First, I'm going to turn the bias. Press F1. Enter BIOS menu. Now, this is the current version we're on. We're updating it to 1.8. We're going to go ahead and exit the BIOS. one to read this first. If you can read this, if you want to read this further, press F8. Now, since it did that, press escape. Now, you're going to press 2. So this update, this utility updates the system program. Press S if only technical documents directs you to do so. Do you want to continue? Why? Make sure that AC adapter is firmly connected to the system outlet. Yes, it is. Enter. Yes, there's a charge battery installed in the system. Enter. Important, do not power off during an update, otherwise the system may be damaged. Do you wish to want to continue? Yes. Now, updating. This may take a few minutes. Do not remove the power of the computer during the update. Do not remove the USB key during the update. Press enter to restart and allow the CD to remain in the drive until it updates. Now I'm going to press enter. Now it's rebooting. BIOS update starting right now. When we wait, there we go. There we go. Updates beginning. It's the beginning flashing tall blocks of the image 56 
straight too. Left hands are gonna rev up. There it goes. This whole thing wrapped up. Just don't turn it off. Just stay calm during the update. Keep this plugged in. BIOS flashing finished, BIOS update successfully, system over shut down, reboot after 5 seconds. There we go, BIOS update successful, now stay calm. Gonna go into BIOS. Oh, self healing BIOS backup. Yeah, it's gonna do this every time. It's gonna do this. So now there's another step. It's going to show self healing BIOS backup. So stay calm and wait. And now the fans are going to run up again. After this process is done, just actually don't interrupt. This is the backup recovery BIOS update. Just don't shut it off. Halfway done. There we go. Bios Health System. I oh, couldn't even read it on time. Bios Healing System Recovery finished. And by it's gonna blink a couple of times and it'll be done. There it goes. F2. Oh, F1. Oh, flashing embedded controller do not power off. Just updated the bad controller. F1. There we go. Set up. There we go. Now the new version is 1.80. The new date is 283-621. Thank you.